Hello, this is Mr. Chabry, and what we're going to do now is some VGC battles. So this is the two, um, 2017 International Challenge for the month of May. And what we're going to do is, let's pick a song, um, I'm just going to put a trainer, I guess, um, for the first battle, of course. But this is the exact same team that we used in the April, uh, April friendly, or the April competition. And let's look at this team. So, hmm. So what I'm going to do is lead off with Corfs, Hapu Lele, and Drift Blim because they are wonderful leads. But I'm also going to bring. So I need to. Hmm. Oh, that. Um. Yeah. So, um, this person's got quite a few threats, of course, um, but I think, I don't want to bring Muck because of Mudsdale, so I think I might bring Gyarados, I think that's a good one, and Marowak, that way we don't have to worry about the uh, Raichu. All right, so let's see what he's bringing in. Of course, Kartana is a big threat, but I think Mirawak should be able to handle that. So Tapu Lele and Driftblim have a really nice, um... Okay, so Serena and Kartana, so... Got some grass types on the field. So we'll set up the Psychic Surge. I think both Kartana and um, Sarina are physical attackers, though. But what we're going to do is just try to get rid of them. So, Empower Fire on the Kartana. Get rid of that, because that thing is massively crazy. Like, massive attack. So if we don't get rid of that, the thing could just destroy a, an entire team. So what we're going to do is Tailwind with Drift Blim. Okay, so the switch, Sarina. Ribombi is coming in. I'm not sure what Ribombi does. Alright, so we're taking a Smart Strike. Oh, oh gosh. That thing's faster than my... My Choice Scarf Tapu Lele. Oh, man. That's annoying. So we'll get the Tailwind. The thing has to be Choice Scarfed. Alright, so I think we should bring in Gyarados. What could Rabombi do to Gyarados? I'm not so sure it can do much. But we're just going in with Gyarados. We'll get the Intimidate. Especially on that Kartana. That thing is a threat. Alright, so this is actually the first time we're doing this competition live. Um, actually... Dragon Dance. We need a Dragon Dance first, I think. Okay, we'll go ahead and Dragon Dance. Probably going to switch Kartana out, honestly. But I still want to Will-O-Wisp that spot. Or I could disable just in case he wants to continue with the Smart Strike. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and just risk it there. Alright, so... He's got to be Choice Scarf because he outsped my Choice Scarf to Tapu Lele. So, Smart Strike has been disabled. Alright, so Speed Swap. So, it just. Mm, ah! Alright, because Rabombe has crazy speed. But now Rabombe has even more speed. So I'm going to Hydro Vortex Rimbombe. And I'm just going to... Okay, so, so far we've seen Sarina. I don't want to Willow this Wisp if that last... What is the chance? I'll just Shadow Ball. I think that's safe. 
Yeah, so withdrawal. Mudsdale. Okay, so actually, um, the will o -Wisp would be pretty safe there. Alright, so we're going to get the Hydro Vortex on Rumbombe. Ah, oh, I see what this tactic is. He wants to give the speed swap to uh, Mudsdale. That's the tactic. That was probably planned. But we're going to just get rid of this Rumbombe. Rumbombe. Ribbon. Alright, so it's out. And we've seen his other Pokemon. Do we still have the Tailwind? How much more Tailwind do we have? So Serena is coming in. Um, I think we still have... Alright, so... One turn... Tailwind. I think... We need a Waterfall Mudsdale. Yeah, because Mudsdale is a big threat, especially to our Marowak. Um, and I'm going to Will-O-Wisp. Arena, I guess. Because that thing is a physical attacker. I want to get it burnt. I want to, honestly, I really want to burn that Kartana. Alright, so we're just improving his defense. Alright, so, so Gyarados taking a trot kick. Our attack has fallen. Body slam. That's going to hurt Gyarados. Alright, but we live because of that burn. Our Tailwind has petered out. What we're going to do is just... I think... Another water... F Actually, wait. Think about that. I think we need to protect with Gyarados, actually. Because he's trying to double down on Gyarados. And I'll just Tailwind. Yeah, I'll, I'll protect with Gyarados. Because... Because he's trying to take Gyarados out. Right now, that's probably his biggest thought. Even though I still have Marowak, he wants to get rid of Gyarados. Alright, so that's good. Nice, nice. Alright, so we're we're sitting pretty good right now. Unfortunately, we lost the weirdness on our build, but right now that doesn't matter. We're going to Waterfall Mudsdale, and we're going to disable Sarina's Trop Kick so we don't lose any more attack. I don't want to lose any more of my attack. So, Choice Scarfed, Kartana is coming in. We need to burn Kartana. That's really our best bet. But, if I had to make a guess, he's probably going to try to get rid of my Drifblim. Hmm. So, I think we need to Ice Fang Sarina. And we'll just Will-O-Wisp Artana right now. I think we'll do that for right now. Yeah, so that way it's not going to do so much damage. And the next turn, I'll actually just Shadow Ball the Cartana. Leaf Blade. Okay, so... That's, that's actually pretty good. Alright, so Arena's going for play rough. Oh, Driplim's really nice. I like Driplim. Um, I 
it really helped burning that Kartana. Alright, so I'm just Ice Fanging Sirena and Disable. Actually, I'll just Shadow Ball the Kartana. Kartana has horrible special defense. Alright, so they're both down in the red, and Leaf Blade's not... I don't... Yeah, Gyarados is going to live that. Sarina has flinched. I mean, honestly, I don't think Sarina's going to do... Sarina could have taken out the Gyarados from where it's at. But right now, it's just the waiting game. Our Tailwind has petered out. Okay, so... Um... Of that. Actually, we just Shadow Ball, I think. I think we're pretty safe in just Shadow Balling. We Shadow Ball Kartana, get rid of that. The match was forfeited. Okay, so we did pretty good there. We've only lost our Tapu Lele to that first turn Smart Strike. So, let's go ahead and do our second battle of the day. I don't need to save it, because whenever Pokemon Moon has an update I got to fix some sort of mechanic in battling, um, it's going to completely make our battle videos unviewable. And we'll have them here on YouTube, so we don't need them, really. I'll just put Lusamine. Yeah, I, th I think I've actually got the speakers on mute, but it's still recording the music. So... I'll just put it on this. So we'll have some variety. So I decided to try this instead of the um, narrated ones. I only did the narrated one because I was like, you know, it'd be nice just to have narrated videos just like good old times. But I'm going to try it live because I think if I do a live battle, it kind of helps me. Um, strategize. So let's see, we've got Tapu Coco, Tapu Lele, Artana, he has a Drift Bloom, um, Arcanine, and um, Garchomp. So I think Slim here has probably got the same idea that I have. Drift Bloom, Tapu Lele. Um, but it's such a good lead that I'm going to do it again. Um, I'm going to bring Muck, actually. Muck. And... I think, uh, well, I need something for Kartana because as we see, as we seen in that last battle, Kartana is a big threat. And actually, Tapu Koko is a big threat. Well, that Garchomp is a big threat as well. Um, I think it'll be safe going with Marowak, however. Yeah, I think this is our safest play right now. We'll go with this. Alright, let's see what we've got. Alright, Slim, are you leading off with the same leads that I'm leading off with? That is the question. Epucoco and Kartana. Alright, so, ow. Um. I think it's going to be an electric terrain since. Yeah, so we're going to have to fight in the electric terrain. These are actually the best leads against my leads, so. I think Driftblim can actually take. Maybe like a Thunderbolt. So I'll just Tailwind. And I think I'll have to switch. Actually, we're going to bring Marowak in. Marowak should be able to take a Smart Strike and prevent the electricity that Tapu Koko is about to shoot 
out at Driplim. So I think Marowak is actually a really good switch right here. Alright, so this is actually like really good, I think. It'll prevent our Drift Bloom from being taken out by a Thunderbolt. Yep, there, there's the Thunderbolt. So Marowak is doing pretty good there. Raised our special attack, which we don't use. And Smart Strike is coming after Marowak. Pretty, pretty good there. Didn't do too much. I'm just going to sh I think Will-O-Wisp, the Cartana, because that thing's a threat, and Bone Meringue, the Coco. Hold on, let me see what he's got. He's probably switching. Um, okay, could have Drift Blim, but a part of me thinks he's probably not going to switch Drift Blim in here. So yeah, I think we'll go ahead and Bone Meringue the Coco. Alright, so Coco's protecting. That's pretty good. Pretty good right there. Okay, so scouting. This isn't the choice scarfed Artana. Alright, so... I mean, but Slim does have Arcanine, so he's probably going to switch Arcanine on the Kartana slot. So I'm just going to burn the... K Actually, I think just Shadow Ball Kartana slot now. And... Shadow Bone... The Coco slot. I think, I think that's better, because he's going to be expecting me probably to do the same exact thing that I did. Alright, so Garchomp's coming in. So we did pretty good, I guess. Right, so there's the Tapu Lele. Alright, so we're we're Shadow Balling that now. We're going to Shadow Ball that. Alright, so the special defense drop. We're going to Shadow Ball, or Shadow Bone. Gurchomp. And he has a defense drop. Wow, that was pretty good. That's pretty good right there. Um, I don't really see a reason not to do the same exact thing I just did. I'm just going to Shadow Ball Tapu Lele. And I'm actually going to detect so I don't take an Earthquake. I think that's my best play right now. Because I don't want to take an Earthquake. So Tapu Lele is going for Protect. Oh, Earthquake it is. I see. I see. It's the Earthquake. Yeah. Our Tailwind has petered out, though, so that's not good. Um, I've got to Tailwind again. And... Um, I don't think he's going, I need to save, you know, so I think I need to switch into Tapu Lele. Of course, his Tapu Lele is not choice scarfed, as we saw. He wanted to have went for Protect. Okay, is Muck going to be doing very much for us? Let's see. I don't think Muck, I mean, Muck's good for Tapu Coco, but that's it. Oh, I just timed out. I just timed out. Alright, so Tailwind. That is unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. I ran out of time. I ran out of time. Marowak is my, was really all I had. And now I don't have Marowak. That just ruined me. Oh my gosh, that just ruined me.
Got a Shadow Ball Garchomp. Get rid of it. That thing's... Oh my gosh. I gotta protect Muck. Muck's... <laughs> that... Uh, that t I, I wasn't paying attention to my time. I think that... That's... Ah. Uh, okay, he's taking out his own Kartana here. I think. I don't know. Yeah, so he took out his own Kartana. But, wow. We just ran out of time, and that... Oh, man. That Marowak is really what we needed to win. I was going to switch Muck in. And Smuck's not going to be doing much for us. And so Shadow Ball. The Marowak is what we need it to win, though. Oh, man. Okay. He'll do this. I need to take out Garchomp. Muck can go for Poison Jab. On the Coco. Yeah. We got a Poison Jab Coco. Right, so the Protect, of course, because Garchomp's going for Earthquake. We're going to get rid of Garchomp. So, now the last Pokemon is his Tapu Lele. Alright, so... We have seen, though, that... I still have the Tailwind. How much more Tailwind do I have? This is my last Tailwind. Um, got a Shadow Ball, the Lele slot, and Jab, the Coco slot. Probably protecting with Lele. Okay, no. So we're going to get a Shadow Ball on the Lele. I'm going to bring it down close to being taken out. Alright, Muck's taking that. Muck is a wonderfully defensive Pokemon. Alright, so we might still have this, actually. Yeah, I think... Actually, yeah. I think we still have this. Going for a... Psychic, some, something psychic. Or so, Shattered Psyche. He's actually going to attack, going to take out Drifblim. Of course, he's not going after Muck because Muck has dark typing. Alright, so I think we still win this, actually. Our Tillwind's petered out, but that I don't think that matters. We've got. Yeah, we can Shadow Sneak. Yeah, we, we still win this. So, I'm just hitting Moon Blast. And, well, oh yeah, we don't have Shadow Sneak. Duh, okay, but we'll just Poison Jab. It doesn't matter. I'm used to ha Muck having Shadow Sneak. But we won, so... Wow, that we almost lost because I wasn't paying attention to the turn time. But anyway, that's going to be all the the VGC battles for today. Um, come in next um, next time, maybe tomorrow. I'll probably have the next one posted tomorrow. And we're going to have two more battles for this competition. And I might do some more. This might be the week of VGC. Um, but anyway, if you like this, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next battle video.